Hello everybody, welcome back to One Leaf Tarot Family. How are you all doing? I hope you're all doing well and keeping safe. Thank you so very much to all of my beautiful kind soul subscribers out there for all of your love and support. If you're new to my channel, welcome. I hope you join our beautiful community here as well. Everybody, I'm back with another pick a card reading. And for today's reading, I will be looking at messages from your guardian angel. Okay, so to help you choose, I've put some feathers and gemstones. Okay, so for group one, I have the red jasper with this beautiful feather. Okay. And for group two, I have Lapis Lazuli with this beautiful white feather. For group three, I have the Rose Quartz. this beautiful feather sort of like a touch of grayish black on the tip there okay and for group four I have the halite stone with this beautiful feather. Okay, with a touch of brown or coffee. Okay, so group one, two, three, and four. If you're drawn to more than one group, it's absolutely okay. You can listen to more than one group or even four groups if your intuition tells you to do so. When you are ready, you will find the timestamps noted in the description box and the comment section below. I will see you in your reading. Hello group one, for those that have been drawn to the red jasper and this beautiful feather, this is going to be your reading. Okay, so group one, what I'm going to do is to start off your reading, I'm going to pull a couple messages here from my chopsticks divination tool. Okay, so spirit, this is for group one, may I please have to opening messages from their, their guardian angel, please. Okay, so we've got timing. And we got slowly but surely. Beautiful. Your guardian angel wants you to know that you are where you're supposed to be. You are not too late or too early. It's all about timing. Don't worry about the timing. You are not off track or it and or you are not ahead of the game trust in the process because once the timing is right you are going to get your wishes you're gonna get your manifestation there's no such thing as timing in the universe or in the cosmo Don't wait for the right time to move forward towards your dreams. 
This is the time to move forward. You are always being led to the right place at the right timing. Don't question the process. The key is to trust that your guardian angel is always on your side, always leading you to the right people, to the right situation, aligning you at the right timing or the perfect timing. Wow, it's what I'm hearing for this message here. Slowly but surely. Beautiful. Things may have been very slow for some of you, but trust that it's surely are working behind the scenes by your guardian angel. Just because you don't see things happening right now, it does not mean that things are not moving towards the right timing for you. Trust that things are moving, things are progressing, the way they should be. You don't need to know when or why and how, but know that things are moving towards the right direction and your manifestation, your goals, your dreams are moving towards your direction and they are going to be presented to you at the right timing. Wow, such beautiful opening message from your guardian angel, group one. Okay, so let me look at some tarot cards to dig a little bit deeper. Okay, so spirit, this is for group one. Please show us what are the messages that their guardian angel have for them today? Please and thank you. Okay, so we have the King of Cups. Wow, we have the Queen of Cups. Chariot. We have the two swords. We have the Empress. Guardian Angel is wanting you to understand the importance of tapping into your emotional aspect of self. And some of you, I'm hearing that you are very intuitive and you should listen to your intuition. They are guiding you to be your best self. Whatever situation that you're in, it is important that you're able to balance your emotions 
okay and your love towards self especially and others around you step up to be in the leadership role and at the same time be in this graceful a positive high vibrational energy in order to be prepared for this beautiful abundance or expansion that is coming towards you some of you may be going through some type of tough situations right now or unclarity or you're not sure what's ahead of you there's some type of beautiful abundance and security ahead of you which will help you step ahead and you're going to be expanding into something bigger is what i'm seeing for you i'm hearing like lots of balance ahead of you and there's lots of beautiful birth of new things okay so let me look at another tarot deck to see if i can find further messages for you So just let me move these here. Okay, so may we please have additional messages from their guardian angel spirit. This one wants to come out. We have another three of wands here. Wow, okay. So we have the king of swords. We have another king card here. The chariot, another chariot. Wow. The high priestess. Like I mentioned, some of you, your intuition is... Titan, okay, is what I'm hearing. Listen to your intuition. It's going to show you the way. The star. And we have the seven of swords. All right. So we have the two of swords and the seven of swords. I'm hearing that some of you are fearing your current situation, fearing that things are not going to get better. If you are currently encountering in some type of tough situation or even if you are currently are content with your situation you are also fearing that perhaps the other shoe is gonna drop there's a sense of fearing that things are going to go wrong um, perhaps some of you in the past have gone through some really difficult times your guardian angel is letting you know that things are not going to go bad like the past okay and if you're currently experiencing tough situation things are only going to get better okay with this king of swords here be in your power be in your most authentic self speak your truth this is the time to do it because things are only going to get better for you with this three of wands here with two two three of wands cards showing up things are going to expand things are going to grow for you very quickly with two chariot cards showing up here wow and please listen to your intuition because some of you are highly intuitive in fact, others of you, I feel that you're psychic here. So please use that powerful psychic energy or that beautiful intuition that you have, group one, and follow that, okay? Because 
things are moving okay we have to slowly but surely and these two cards the two chariot cards showing up for your reading group one i feel that this is like a double confirmation for you that things are moving even though at times it's very slowly but they are surely moving and i'm seeing two quick moving energy cards here i feel that things are going to speed up for you okay and you're definitely moving towards growth and expansion and some type of wish is going to come true so you know don't let your mind fool you don't let any blockages stop you from moving forward i'm seeing a lot of like i'm seeing castle here and i'm seeing two castles behind um this chariot card here and i'm seeing like another castle here so you are moving towards your the beautiful empire that you've always wanted to build for yourself or this beautiful security or this beautiful home that you've always wanted to create for yourself group one so keep going okay um you are in the right divine timing so nothing is moving too slow or too fast everything is where they should be at this point in time okay so have lots of hope stay hopeful because things are just going to get better for you wow okay so what i'm gonna do is i'm going to draw one card from this oracle deck to get additional messages for you. Okay. We have harmony and resolution. Wow, okay. So what I'm seeing for you for this card is that things are going to be more balance things are going to come into harmony i mentioned earlier that if you're going through any obstacles or tough situations you're going to come to a resolution i feel that your guardian angel is asking you to let go okay of those that um have not treated you well or have not been there for you let go of all of that i'm hearing that gratitude prayers as well as listening to your intuition are the two best things that you should do at this time in order to help you stay hopeful in order to help you stay in this high vibrational energy in order to help you move forward towards brightness, towards growth, towards stability and harmony. And things are going to come together. Step up to your fullest potential and you know you have lots of potentials. Group one is what I'm hearing. As long as you are not harming yourself and others around you, it is totally okay to exercise all of these beautiful qualities and gifts that you have from within. As I mentioned, some of you are very psychic here, so use it to the best of your abilities. You're always going to resolve any tough situation. I'm hearing the number nine. Use number nine, okay? You're gonna you're gonna resolve any conflicts when you use the, the number nine is what i'm hearing okay so what i'm gonna do now is i'm going to pull you some charms lots of charms group one so we have the cactus here so things like i mentioned maybe some of you have been you know feeling that people are you know sucking you dry leaving you in the dark 
you know, just they just come and take, 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 and they never give. Okay, but things are going to get better for you. And this mermaid here, I feel like this this charm reminds me of the the high priestess. Like I mentioned, you are very psychic and you are totally in tune with you know your environment and with the energy around you and you can actually read energy for some of you here so tap into that you are going to go so far with this beautiful gift that you have group one is what i'm hearing wow and i'm seeing a little girl here okay this reminds me of like the inner child okay and um, maybe some of you um, there's some inner child healing that you have to do and for others of you i am um, usually i don't like to say this in my reading especially it's a general reading but seeing this little girl and the empress here i'm hearing that some of you could be pregnant or will be pregnant okay and this is just for some of you obviously okay and i'm seeing this moon with a star here i feel that um, things are going to be very hopeful for you or I'm also hearing that please stay hopeful because things are just going to get better for you and no, the other shoes are not is not going to drop, okay? And we have the strawberry here, I think. I only have one strawberry, okay? In this, in my whole entire charm box here, okay? So this is definitely um, reminds me of love there's so much love around you okay so your guardian angel wants you to know that they love you very much and they are constantly outpouring their love towards you protecting you protecting your space okay and um, with this heart shaped lock here i feel that your guardian angel is asking you to open up okay to receiving love because you're so deserving of receiving love wow and we have the candy here things are just going to get sweeter and sweeter okay so know that with this snowflake your guardian angel wants you to know that you are one unique soul and they're always there to protect you okay so step up to your leadership role because you got this wow it's what i'm hearing and with this palm tree here i feel that things are gonna get brighter okay definitely going to get brighter um, palm tree reminds me of like in a hot tropical area and in those areas you'll find lots of like sunlight and warmth right so things are just going to get brighter for you okay um, with this these three floating balloons here i feel that you are ascending you are expanding like these two uh three of wands card here things are definitely getting um there's going to be growth and expansion okay you are moving towards the right direction and the timing is perfect for you and with this unicorn here wow like i said you guys are very magical very psychic there's just beautiful gifts that you have from within that you your guardian angel is wanting you to know that and is wanting you to believe in your strength okay and never to give up and with this leaf here i feel that some of you are going to feel a sense of renewal okay after this quick moving energy that your guardian angel is going to show you or to um lead you towards okay the right place at um, the right timing there's going to be a renewal or rebirth of um like with this empress card here there's lots of abundance um because of this renewal or expansion that you are going to be moving towards it's what i'm seeing here for you beautiful group one that was the messages from your guardian angel Thank you so very much, Guardian Angel of Group 1, for showing up for this reading. Group 1, wherever you are, please take very good care of yourself and stay very safe. Thank you for being here with me today. 
I will see you in your next reading. Bye. Hello, group two, for those that have been drawn to the lapis lazuli and this beautiful feather. This is going to be your reading. Okay, so group two, what I'm going to do is I'm going to pull you a couple messages from my chopsticks divination tool to start off your reading. So spirit, can you please show us a couple messages from their guardian angel for group two? Okay, so the first message we have respect. Second message we have you got this. Wow. Okay, so group two, um, like I just did for group one, as I'm reading, I'm also channeling. Okay, so maybe I sometimes I'm speaking as if. I'm speaking through, or your guardian angel is speaking through me, okay? So for this message, you got this. Your guardian angel is cheering you on. If you are currently experiencing a tough situation, you got this, group two. You can overcome this. You can conquer this. It's a piece of cake. Trust your judgment. Trust that you can handle anything that comes towards you, whether they are good or bad. You have so much inner strength in you to handle any situation. Bring out the boss in you. Even if at times of your lowest, don't give up. You're so close to your goal, to your dreams. Think about it this way, group two. The moment you want to give up is the moment. It's this is the moment that you're only one step away from reaching your goal, reaching your dreams. Because you got this group two. Wow. Respect. Respect self. Respect who you are. Respect is what you need to give yourself respect is what you fully deserve from self and others respect your space respect is what will get you to many places you are going to receive so much respect so much love people are going to look up to you paying respect To those that have helped you or even to your guardian angel is going to get you so far ahead is what I'm hearing for these two messages group two this is beautiful okay so let me go and look at your cards to dig a little bit deeper So group 
two spirit this is for group two messages from their guardian angel please show us okay so we've got justice and we've got the magician we've got page of swords we've got the lovers We've got the King of Wands. Okay. Again, as I'm reading the cards, I'm also channeling, okay? Um, so maybe your guardian angel will speak through me. Things are going to be balanced out for you. Like we talked about this, you got this message. You have such beautiful strength from within that you're able to create magic into reality. But first you need to balance your energies. You need to respect who you are respect your beautiful self the beautiful things that you have even when others tell you otherwise respect that you have this beautiful gift and magic from within and respect that you have the spiritual gift that you can create and co-create with the universe with your guardian angel they are blessing you with so much strength and power. They are giving you all their resources and tools so that you can stand so tall and be in your authentic self and see the beautiful gift and energy that you have from within, actually had from your past life. Wow, you are an old soul. There's this beautiful new beginning, beautiful connection. You're going to be embarking towards. This could be a soulmate connection or a connection with your guardian angel or some type of partnership, a soul tribe family type of connection. Your guardian angel is here to let you know how powerful you are. Only you can bring out this beautiful energy, this beautiful gift from within when you're able to balance your heart space emotionally and intellectually. You are going to come to realize this once you have a clear mindset. You're going to get some type of messages either on a cloudy day or on a very sunny day, group two. Wow. Okay, so I'm going to use another deck and see what other messages your guardian angel is wanting to let you know, okay? Okay, wow. I'm gonna try to 
to shuffle and try one more time. So guardian angel of group two. Okay, spirit, can you please show us messages from guardian angel of group two? We have the Four of Wands. Okay, I feel this one. The Knight of Coins. And the Page of Coins. Okay, so if some of you are asking for some type of soulmate connection, I'm seeing here, even though this is a four of wands, I'm seeing a couple and I'm seeing a couple here. So I feel that your guardian angel is letting you know that there's either some type of soul mate connections, soul tribe connections, or re reconciliation with your person that your guardian angel is going to align you with, with the right people, with the right places. You need to be extra strong and trust in your power and be in this magician energy make sure that you are aligning everything you are balancing everything i'm hearing that everything needs to be balanced in terms of your energy space in order for you to be able to come into your powerful self like this magician card here so you need time, okay? Your guardian angel is saying you need to take things slowly. Don't rush the process and respect yourself for this, okay? I feel that some of you may have been feeling very defeated or frustrated towards self and others, particularly towards self that you feel like you can't help your situation and you can't seem to move things forward your guardian angel is asking you to relax okay and be in this page of coins energy be in the playful energy because i feel that any security that you're looking for any stability that you're looking for any harmony that you're looking for. I see here with the Knight of Coins and the Page of Coins, I'm seeing sort of like a pentacle. She's wearing a pentacle and there's a, a pentacle here on this ox here that um, he's riding. So I feel that you've always had this stability from within or you need to achieve this stability in order for you to create magic in your world okay there's so much stability ahead of you although things have been moving very slowly and again you need to respect the process because you got this in you okay you can create this stability, okay? Or this soulmate connection or this reconciliation. When you respect yourself, respect who you are and take all the time, okay? Respect the timing. Wow, okay. So I feel that your guardian angel doesn't want to say much. 
they want you to know your power okay whenever you feel like you are off in terms of your energy that's when things are not going to move forward for you so you need to always be in the balance in order for you to be able to handle any situations that come towards you whether they are good or bad it's what i'm hearing okay so i'm gonna see if i can get one oracle message from this deck here for you okay we have power and intention so beautiful this card reminds me of the magician card holy okay so group two you definitely have this beautiful magic from within that you can manifest anything you want you have so much power and you just need to set the right intention you need to balance your space and you can manifest magic into your world okay you see how powerful he looks okay you have this strong you have this fiery energy from within and i'm seeing all this purple here purple reminds me of like healing and and intuition beautiful psychic power energy that you have from within that you need to know and all these brightness okay so and all these brightness in the background there's so much brightness ahead of you there's so much beautiful things waiting for you okay you need to respect yourself for that respect it and know that you got this okay you need to believe that things are only going to get better. Wow, such beautiful and powerful message. Guardian angel for group two. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pull you some charms. okay so we have the star there's so much hope and you are the star okay know that you can create so many beautiful things for yourself and for others and people are gonna respect you like a star wow and with this flower here you can make magic Things are only going to get better and blossom like this beautiful flower for you, group two, okay? And with this music here, I feel that you are going to be the last that will, the person that will be laughing, okay? You are going to create your own music, some of you here, and listening to music can relax you and can also bring you um, to this balance of your energy space in order to help you create magic into your world group two this is such beautiful energy that i'm getting from your guardian angel i feel that with your guardian angel they're very strict okay um they're old soul um i feel that um your guardian angel could be someone that is um uh, your ancestor from your ancestral line or lineage okay i feel that they are strict at the same time they are watching you very closely and they want what's best for you i'm getting like the tough love energy from your guardian angel they want to tell you yet they don't want to tell you because they want you to find your own gift they want you to dig deeper into self okay and because once you do that things are just going to like shine so bright okay so hang in there group two because you got this and you need to respect who you are you need to know how much how beautiful all this gift that you have from within 
and that you can bring so much beautiful things into reality for yourself and for others around you okay that was all the messages that i have for you from your guardian angel group too i'm sending you lots of love and light wherever you are please take very good care of yourself and stay safe i will see you in your next reading bye hello group three for those that have been drawn to rose cords and this beautiful feather this is going to be your reading okay so group three we are here to look at messages from your guardian angel to start off your reading. I'm going to use this chopsticks divination tool to draw out two opening messages for you, okay? Okay, so the very first message that came out, forget and forgive love wow how beautiful is that so group three like the last couple groups um their angel or their guardian angel um throughout some of or some parts of their readings they have been speaking through me so sometimes um you're, you're going to hear that from uh, your reading or for your reading as well. Okay, so I feel that um, so far for my last couple groups, their readings are a little bit different from my usual reading because I feel that with this reading, um, the air garden angels have spoken through me and I feel that um, this is going to be happening for the rest of the, uh, the groups, including yours, okay? All right, so forget and forgive. Group three, it is time to let go, embrace the tough times, the people that were not there for you, the people that abandoned you, the people that mistreated you, the people that jaded you, the people that have suck you dry that all they do is come and take 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 and take your guardian angel wants you to embrace all of that and let go and forgive these people by letting go and by forgiving this will release your soul from any pain and any negativity your soul deserves beauty and positivity and not any low vibration energy that these people have given you. Also, you need to forgive yourself. You need to let go of any guilt, any shame. No one's perfect. Don't strive per, for perfection. Strive for what's best for you, but not for perfection. If you did your best, know that that's all you need to do. So you need to forget all the errors, all the mistakes, all the mishaps that, ha that have had happened to you, either created by self or others. You are just going to 
grow and learn and be someone better today and tomorrow. Wow. Group three. Your guardian angel is truly wanting you to have lots of healing energy in your space. Love. Love is such a powerful healing energy that anybody can have no matter any situation even the toughest situation when you apply the energy of love this can solve the toughest time the toughest thing that you are encountering love is what we have all brought to this 3d world to learn to embrace to have and to give love love is the highest vibrational energy that anyone can give to self and others love is what your guardian angel wants you to focus on love can bring you so much positivity so much hope so much power so much dreams coming true abundance alignment to your highest good and to those that you care for love can bring you all the happiness that you are so deserving wow so beautiful group three i love your opening messages from your guardian angel okay so let's see if we can look at your cards to dig a little bit deeper okay wow okay feel that that wants to come out okay so spirit this is for group three what messages does their guardian angel have for them please and thank you we have the three of cups okay so we have the magician that came out and then the three of cups we have the seven of swords We have the High Priestess. We have the Five of Swords. And we have the Seven of Pentacles. Group three. Wow. Okay, so your angel, your guardian angel is going to speak through me as I'm reading these cards for you, okay? You can create so much happiness and collaboration, celebration with others, with a community, with like-minded people. It is time to align your beautiful vibrational energy with the right people with the right community you are able to dive into the light and the dark you are able to show others the dark side and the light side how do you do that Group three is by sharing your beautiful love energy, by showing others 
that you are able to forget and forgive others. You are able to not let the past hinder your dreams and the progress that you have made to date. You are willing to apologize and to accept apologies from others. You are willing to work really hard towards reconciliation because you believe that love can bring so much harmony, so much happiness, because you know love, it's a solution to any problems. Your guardian angel is always here for you, always showing you the right path. They know that you're looking for stability. I feel that in four weeks or in four months, a guardian angel is going to bring some type of blessings to you. Pay attention to the number four. You are going to experience some type of stability in your space or some type of blessings, harmony, energy, some type of unexpected events that is going to bring a smile to your face and you're going to be celebrating. Wow, okay. Group two, I'm going to get another deck. Let's see if I can get more messages for you. Us. Okay, so group three, like I mentioned, in four weeks or four months, you're going to have this unexpected event or news that is going to, or blessings that you're going to experience that is going to shake your foundation in a good way. Your guardian angel loves you, group three, so not to worry. Anything that no longer serves you, they're going to strip it down and they're going to help you rebuild a stronger foundation, okay? Um, and I feel that there's going to be some type of blessings that they're going to um, bring towards you and you're just going to be progressing. You're moving up, you're progressing, you're elevating and there's going to be definitely balance and justice Okay, I feel good karma. Okay, so this blessing or this event that is going to um, be cast upon you, that's going to be brought by your guardian angel towards you, is going to bring you some type of clarity and justice. Okay, you are going to be able to speak the truth about something here. Maybe perhaps some type of communication you're going to find out about a person or a situation that is going to help you move forward. Okay. 
and you're going to be able to be in this magician energy and this high priestess energy is what I'm hearing. Okay, or you should be or try to vibrate in this energy level. Know your strength, okay? And be in the energy of love. That way you can tap into your beautiful magical power and this beautiful intuitive or this great intuition that you have from within, okay? I feel that all those that no longer serve you, your guardian angel, all the conflicts or all the deception, I feel that they're going to strip this all down, okay? They're going to bring you brightness, bring you justice, okay? Wow. Okay. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to see if I can get you one oracle message. So spirit one oracle message messages from group three's garden angel, please and thank you. Feel this one. Manifestation. Wow. So, with all of this beautiful purple color surrounding this angel, I feel that like this forgive, forget and forgive message and love, okay? I feel that there's lots of healing energy that your garden angel is going to bless you with, okay? And is asking you to let go, okay? And you're going to be healed by all that have hurt you, all the wounds, all the pain that others have caused you. Or perhaps some of you have inflicted, self-inflict this, self-inflict, okay? It's what I'm hearing. But your guardian angel is wanting you to know that they are here to heal you, okay? And I feel that you can manifest healing energy into your space in order to help you come into your full power, okay? To become this magician and this high priestess energy. I feel that with the combination of healing manifestation into your space once this is this has come to your space which your guardian angel is going to help you with you're gonna be able to get into this magician energy and this high priestess energy group three such beautiful energy that i'm feeling for you there's so much love and hope Okay, that your guardian angel is wanting you to have and love okay for yourself and for others despite what have happened in the past because once you've healed yourself once you have put love into any situation that you're in you can create magic into your life. You can manifest anything you want into your life. Things are just going to get better for you. Wow, so beautiful. Okay, I'm going to get you some charms. Okay. We have a square. I always see this either as a triangle, I don't know why, or a diamond. Um, this to me is fiery energy as well as money. <laughs> There's going to be lots of fiery energy. Wow, and I'm looking at this tower, tower card here. I feel that um, 
this is only going to help you um, move forward okay i feel that there's going to be lots of fiery energy moving towards you uh, and once this has come down you're going to have a much more solid foundation moving forward wow i'm seeing a squirrel okay so your garden angel is wanting you to save up at the moment okay um and don't worry no matter what happens things are just going to get better for you and they are sending you lots of love and healing energy towards you so keep going and with this sailboat here everything is smooth sailing despite even if you are going to experience this tower moment again things are just going to get better for you and we have a perfume bottle here group three you are one beautiful kind soul you have so much beautiful things in your space okay that you can create or co-create with your guardian angel you can manifest so many beautiful things into your space and you have such beautiful heart look we have the heart and we have love here there's so much love in your space like i said so stay hopeful know that love can solve any problems okay so put lots of love into any situation that you're in and like i said you are so beautiful and kind one unique soul there's going to be so much brightness ahead of you you're going to feel so much love okay and music wow listen to music group three because this is going to bring you lots of peaceful and harmony energy i'm seeing a lot of black hair black to me is water energy okay water to me is intuition like the high priestess card here that we have you have lots of beautiful intuition from within so bring it out and believe in yourself we have the cantaloupe here there's only one cantaloupe okay in my little container of charms here i think i've got like over a hundred charms here so this to me represents love group three okay there's so much love in your space and love is your key to success even to your worst enemy okay that's what your guardian angel wants you to know once you apply love once you give out love they're going to receive this in their energy space okay because all of us give out energy energy is you know forever moving around the universe and around us so even though they're not saying this but when you give out the love energy they're gonna feel this and things are gonna shift i promise you group three this is so beautiful group three i'm sending you lots of love and light wherever you are please take very good care of yourself thank you so very much guardian angel of group three for showing up for this reading i will see you in your next reading group three bye hello group four for those that have been drawn to this highlight stone and this beautiful feather this is going to be a reading okay so group four before i start i'd like to let you know that all of my three readings have been very different from my usual pick a card reading in that their guardian angel have been speaking through me so you'll find that there's going to be somewhat different um in terms of the way i read the cards and the way i speak um as i'm doing your reading because again your guardian angel is at times speaking through me okay so 
hopefully what you're going to be hearing will make perfect sense to you and that you're able to um, hear some messages that will be resonating um, with all of you okay if not some and uh, i'm hoping all of you all right so to begin with your reading i'm going to draw out a couple messages here from my chopsticks divination tool okay So your first message is you are deserving and the time is now. Wow. Okay. So group four, your guardian angel wants you to know that you are fully deserving of love, fully deserving of happiness, of joy, of beautiful things, of financial abundance, of all your wishes that or all the dreams that you want them to come true you are fully deserving of having plenty having so much love and beautiful people beautiful situations Places where you are deserving to go. Places where you are deserving to be at that will bring you so much happiness and joy and harmony and peace. You are deserving of so much beautiful positivity and energy and high vibrational energy in your heart space. Wow. Okay, so the time is now. Your guardian angel is wanting you to know that this is not the time to fear. This is not the time to stop giving up hope this is not the time to let go of your dreams your manifestation this is the time to step up your game this is the time to do the things that you always wanted to do this is the time to move towards your goal this is the time to not let others hinder your desires to wanting to do more this is not the time to say i'm comfortable and i'm here to stay this is not the time to not act and be in your own power wow okay so group four those are your opening messages. Let me look into the tarot cards to dig a little bit deeper. Okay, so Spirit, please show us messages from Guardian Angel of Group 4. Four of Swords, the Ace of Swords, the Ten of Wands, the Four of Pentacles, Okay. 
the Page of Swords and the Lovers. Okay. I'm going to read this and at the same time your guardian angel is going to read through me as I'm reading the cards, okay? This is the time to be out of feeling stuck. This is the time to not be dwelling into the past. This is the time to coming out of your hermit mode, looking up to the light that you're holding. You're holding a beautiful light that will help you find your way to beautiful things. There's going to be this beautiful beginning that Archangel Michael is trying to cast us upon you. He is giving you his sore, his power that will lead you to the truth, clarity, protection. This isn't the time to give up fighting for what you are so deserving, despite all the burden that you have been feeling, despite how defeated that you have been feeling. This isn't the time to block any of the new beginning that is coming towards you. This isn't the time to let your fear hold you back. There's so much more clarity and hope and fresh energies that we, your guardian angel, want you to know and want you to be embarking towards. There's going to be beautiful new alignment and connections with beautiful people ahead of you. So much brightness. There's going to be so much beautiful soul connections, soulmate connections, soul tribe connections, so much partnership, right-minded people. This is a time to align yourself, align your energy towards those connections. Forget about what happened in the past. Don't let those hinder your future, hinder your progress, hinder this new beginning. You will be protected by Archangel Michael. You're so full deserving of all these beautiful things that awaits you. Wow. Let's see if I can get you further messages. Group four, you're going to feel some kind of coldness in under your feet, I feel, um, in the next little while. And when you feel this coldness or this, um, I don't know, I feel that there's some, something has to do with your feet that you are going to feel some type of sensation. And this is like a sign to let you know that your guardian angel is around okay so remember that okay so guardian angel group four what additional messages do you have for them of coins we have temperance and we have the ten of coins beautiful group four as your guardian angel want you to know that 
all the sweats, all the hard work, all the seeds that you have planted are slowly coming to fruition. There needs to be a beautiful flow of balance, of energy, of love around your space. You need to know that you are full deserving of love. You need not to push yourself too hard. You have to remember that self-love and being authentic are the two most important things. You need to feel deserving in order for your fruit of labor to come into fruition. You are so deserving of happiness. There are going to be so many people, including children, that are going to be so admiring you, admiring who you are. You're going to be attracting people from all different walks of life, from the younger people to the older people, different races, different backgrounds. Sometimes things need time to balance and it's okay for you to experience failure. You need not to be too hard on yourself. You are going to reach so many people, so many admirers, so many followers, different situations that will lead you to many different connections. And these beautiful connections are going to lead you to so much happiness, financial security, stability, laughters, joy, peace, harmony, brightness, so much relaxed and not having to worry that things are going to go wrong. Don't be fearful of what's ahead or what you are going to be encountering. The future is so much more brighter than you think. Our angel Michael is here to lead you. Wow. Okay, thank you. I'm going to pull an article message from this deck here. I feel that some of you here are feeling very drained, feeling very drained, very tied down. I'm getting that like very tired energy. I'm not sure if it's because um, I've been channeling <laughs> um, throughout my four readings and I feel that um, four of my readings so far, their garden angels are so strong and I'm feeling a little bit drained right now, to be honest with you. Good four, okay? Um, perhaps some of you are feeling drained as well. Okay, because I'm I'm feeling that energy, so I'm not sure if it's because I've been, you know, your guardian angel's been talking, or all of your guardian angels been talking through me, or perhaps you are actually feeling very drained and tired. Okay, all right. So I'm gonna pull one oracle message from here. Do the work. Oh, wow. And we've got the time is now. Exactly. Good for the time is now. Go ahead and do the work. Don't be afraid. You have it in you to do what it takes. Okay. Uh, believe in yourself. Believe that you're deserving of this beautiful energy, this beautiful beginning this beautiful protection that your guardian angel wants you to have and wants you to know that you and your loved ones are safe and all you have to do is do the work whatever you want to achieve whatever you want to manifest this is the time to do it this is the time to step up to your game like i mentioned earlier because they are there 
watching over you, protecting every step of the way. Go ahead, group four. Go ahead. Don't be afraid. Don't fear. Move forward. Wow. Okay, so I'm going to read your charms. beautiful keys here you are the only group that has key and you have not one but two keys group four this is so beautiful do the work this is the time to do it the time is now and you are going to have so much success and happiness and abundance because you have the key okay so this key here i feel it's financial success you have the key for towards financial success you have the key to open that door to financial success and this key i feel it's the heart shape you have the key to beautiful love okay to all that you are deserving okay love and abundance in terms of financial security freedom so this is so beautiful and synchronistic thank you so much guardian angel of group four and with this turtle here i feel that some of you have been feeling that things have been moving so slow and even at times you feel so discouraged and to the point where you feel like you're not deserving of love of beautiful things in your life group four you're so deserving okay so even though things may not seem at times that you are deserving of love and that you are heading towards happiness and love you are hang in there things are moving slowly but surely wow and we have oh my god we have a fish fish to me represents abundance okay there's definitely lots of beautiful abundance in all aspects of your life more than enough you're gonna have more than enough love money financial gains financial stability like this ten of coins or ten of pentacles group four so beautiful Thank you so much, Guardian Angel of Group 4, for this beautiful message, for this beautiful assurance for Group 4 to move forward with their journey. Group 4, wherever you are, please take very good care of yourself and stay safe. I'm sending you lots of love and light. I will see you in your next reading. Bye.